Hello guys, welcome to another new video. This is Crypto Everything here again with a quick update on how to be a Mossy signer on the Optimism um, Network. Okay, so uh, in my previous video, I promised you I was going to show you how to be a multi signer because it turns out this was one of the criteria uh, to be, uh, you know, eligible for the previous airdrop on the Optimism and those that did the multi signing had more airdrops, okay, uh, so more uh, had more allocations. So today I'm going to be showing you how to do that exactly, okay, on the Optimism Network, okay. So I'm going to leave all the links in the description below. So once you come over here, um, uh, you just follow me, okay. So, so what this multi signing does for you is, uh, it helps you, you know, helps you uh, secure your wallet more, okay, when you are doing transactions, okay. So you know when you want to send um, a token or from your wallet down to a different wallet, or uh, you do not need to, you do not need another person to approve that before you can do that you have to approve it from your wallet but if you uh, if you, you are doing a multi-signing okay so whenever you want to send coins or uh, crypto from that particular chain um the major wallet or the amount of wallets that you put in there will have to uh you know approve them first before the transaction to finally be approved so that is uh one of the safe ways for you to use um, your crypto wallets without being compromised okay so um first thing we want to do right here um is um create a, a new safe wallet okay the reason why we are doing this is because for the second airdrop that is going to happen okay aside doing the quest for uh, the airdrop okay so uh, this could actually be another reason why they might you know what least your wallet for the airdrop so we just want to do this to be on the safer side i'm going to show you step by step how to do that so once you click on the link bring you here the first thing you want to do is click on this new uh, click on new safe okay so now you will need to connect your wallet okay if you connect your wallet make sure you are on the optimism chain Okay, so once you've connected your wallet, the next thing you want to do is continue. Okay, so right now we're gonna give it a name. We can just give it up, up, up to wallet. Okay, uh, we just click on that, and then just this is just for you know for educational purposes only. Okay, so this is the main wallet. This is the wallet you are creating it from. This is gonna be the master key. So whatever wallet wants to send from this has to be confirmed yet um, first in this wallet. Okay, so we're gonna put it. You can just put it on a, Okay, you can just put it on a, and then you have to add another wallet okay you can add as much as many wallets as you want okay so all you have to do is click on add wallet so the more wallets you add the more people that we need to verify the transaction before it is actually approved okay so we can just put in a uh, letter second wallet okay and then how do you get a different wallet address okay so you know this is very is a very um sensitive matter so you all you have to do what i advise you to do is you can go to your metamask okay uh create a different wallet on your metamask so you have two wallets or not on this wallet rather you can use a different extension you can go to you can you know use a chrome or a brave browser you know side by side you put one on meta or uh, put one on chrome put one on brave browser so that you can be able to create a wallet separately on a different extension and then copy the wallet and then put it right here okay so i've already gone ahead to create one and copy the wallet address and i've put it here already so this is the wallet address of the new uh, uh wallets i just created so all you have to do is click on continue but before your transaction is approved they are going to take a little fee say some cents okay it's going to take you about 0 0.001 f okay sometimes it's mostly not like that it's not even up to it's just an approximation okay so i've already created an account i'm just using it as a demo for you so if you click on create it's going to ask you to approve that in your wallet okay so uh, uh if you do that if you do that your this is going to bring you to uh, this next page okay so once you have approved uh this right here once you have approved your wallet this is where it's gonna bring you to okay so this is the fully created uh wallet so now this acts as a different wallet entirely so you can send from your main wallet down to this wallet right here and it still hold your money okay so you send this is the wallet address for whenever you want to send tokens here okay so you can go to your metamask wallet and then send some um optimism um coins here make sure whatever you're sending is on the optimism chain because if you send a different coin um you're from a different um chain down here you are going to lose them so do not send arbitrum um ethereum here to your optimism and right now this only affects the optimism chain on your wallet okay this it doesn't affect your other chains okay so if you want to do this uh, multi-signing for arbitrum you have to create it all over again but this time using the arbitrum um, chain okay so if you want to receive this is where you copy and then go to your metamask and then send some coins down here so if you actually want to send from here down to any different wallet you have to 
let's close down this you have to click on new transaction okay and then send wherever you want to send you click on send tokens okay so if, if you hit if you click right here it's going to show you the two addresses that you got connected to this okay those are the two addresses this is the main wallet and this is the second wallet okay so is this one of what you want to send to or this this is what it's asking you so you can just put it in here okay i want to send it to my main wallet and then click on the asset that you have if you have ethereum it's going to be there and the amount you want to send and then click on next so once you click on next uh it's going to now go to your main wallet prompt you in your main wallet to uh, it's going to tell you wow there's a transaction going on are you aware of this you have to confirm this first before i allow this to to happen okay so if the the address the second address holder or the second address holder wants to send because the person has access to these two if the person wants to send you will not be able to send until the main address actually um uh confirms it so make sure you have access to the two wallets and do that so once you have done that it's going to ask you to approve and once you have approved it then click on next and then it would have sent from here down to whatever wallet you chose to send it to that is how to do it so i will advise you to do it like multiple times as you can see right here if i go to my transaction history as you can see i just did like a, a couple of times you know sent like five times to my wallet to my to both wallets and to and fro to and fro to make sure just in case they want to do you know something uh, like you know you had to have sent like five times first before you for being eligible so i just did, did that and be a multi sign on this is the same this is the same process for arbitrum user if you're an arbitrum user if you want to do this the same procedure step by step the only thing is you have to switch your chain from the optimism down to the public um to the arbitrum as you can see several chains here you can see ethereum arbitrum aurora polygon this and that okay even on my polygon on my arbitrum chain i have the same thing as you can see my arbitrum chain too i have set up my account on arbitrum too just in case they want to do that i have sent several um you can see different transactions already on my arbitrum so this is the same thing you could do to secure safe if uh the martin signing was uh is a criteria to be eligible for the airdrop because we have missed so many airdrops this this shouldn't be one of them okay so um this is all i have for you today guys this is how to be a multi-signer i um make sure you save use and make sure when you are doing airdrops make sure uh, the wallet that you are using it doesn't contain all of your money okay if you are using if your wallet the wallet that you're using for your airdrops is what contains all your money please i'll advise you move that money out right now because it could be compromised nobody knows because my account has been compromised severally oh, so to make sure you use a wallet one particular wallet for uh airdrops and do another wallet to keep your your phones safe and if you enjoyed this video give me a thumbs up give me a like subscribe to my channel and i will see you on the next one guys bye